Hi guys, welcome to AC Technical. In this video, I am going to show you how to fix video TDR failure error on Windows 11 and Windows 10. Video TDR failure is a blue screen error. If you see an error message video TDR failure, then it indicates that driver related to graphics card stops responding or malfunctioning. At that point of time, system will restart automatically to prevent data loss and to restore the things to their default. This can occur due to stability problem in graphics, typically during video editing and gameplay. However, here I'll show you two possible fixes that can surely help to fix stop code video TDR failure BSOD error in Windows 10 and Windows 11. So let's get started. If the GPU driver issue is causing trouble, then this method is appropriate fix for video TDR failure error. First of all, you need to get to the Windows Startup Repair screen. There are two basic ways to getting here. The first option is restart your computer by pressing the power button and simply tap on F8 key while starting up your computer. In my case, the key is F8. The key may be different in your case. It could be F5 or F6 or F7 or F11 and simultaneously you will need to press and hold down the function key as well. And you should see a blue screen saying choose an option. If the first option does not work in your case then try this second option. Press and hold down the power button for 10 seconds to shut down your computer forcefully. After that, turn your computer back on again and press and hold down the power button for 10 seconds to shut down your computer forcefully. Repeat the procedure 3 times, then it will take you to preparing automatic repair log. Now simply click on advanced option, click troubleshoot and then advanced option. Now click on startup settings and then restart. Once it restarts you will see a screen with list of options. Now press 5 or F5 key on the keyboard to enable safe mode with networking and make sure you are connected with the internet. Now keep patience, your system will be reboot and it will boot into safe mode with networking. Once you are able to put Windows in safe mode with networking, then go to Windows Device Manager by right clicking on Windows Start. Now expand the display adapter directory. After that uninstall the GPU driver by right clicking on that. Next go to control panel and open program and features. Now you need to completely uninstall the GPU driver software from here. After completely uninstalling the problematic GPU driver software, 
just reboot once. Now your computer will restart normally and after that hopefully your Windows 11 video TDR failure problem will be solved. And please don't forget to let me know in the comment section. If the first method does not work, then you need to perform system restore by going to Windows recovery mode by following the first method or using Windows recovery media or Windows bootable USB drive. If you don't have a Windows installation media, then here's certain tutorial for you. Now shut down your system by pressing and hold down the power button for 10 seconds. Insert your Windows installation media and go to your PC's BIOS or boot manager to boot from your Windows installation media. Now click on next and click on repair your computer. Ok once you enter in windows recovery environment then click on troubleshoot. After that click on system restore. Now select your operating system. Note, Windows every time creates a system restore point when Windows install an update, driver or application. You can easily use that system restore point to restore your Windows settings. This solution is not effective if the Windows system restore point is turned off and if you have not created a system restore point earlier. Now click on next. Now you have to select the most recently created system restore point and click next. After that you will see the restored drive. Now click on finish and it will ask you for confirmation. Click on yes to confirm. Well now it started just give it a moment here to initialize and please keep patience. Alright, after it's completed, you can see the message system restored completed. The system has been restored to date, your documents have not been affected. Now click on restart button to restart your computer. And after that, hopefully your problem will be solved. After restart is completed, it will automatically open the desktop screen. Alright, now the Windows 11 Pro screen of death issue is fixed. So I hope this guide was helpful for you. If you have any question, then please let us know. Please like, comment and share. We need your support. And guys, please don't forget to subscribe our channel. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.